Hi guys, well, welcome to Chuck Labs. Um, I'm working. I'm currently working on a project which I am going to be uh, uh, sharing very soon with you guys. Um, it's on uh, a cheap, reliable uh, power supply uh, or battery charger uh, that you can uh, use to do multiple things and charge different uh, voltage levels something you can have in your garage something that is really easy to do and affordable so I came across this uh, supply that I've had for many many years and I wanted to do a review on it I've used this guy to do a lot of things from charging different kind of batteries to uh, doing LED drive and in it has been very reliable I've used it you know, in many different uh, rugged applications and uh, um, proved to be very reliable. So I wanted to uh, share this, do a, like a quick brief review so that um, maybe somebody can find this useful and uh, maybe go check it out. Also, I'd like to say that this is not sponsored. I am just uh, doing this to share my experience um, because this is one of the cheapest DC to DC converters uh, that you can find out there. This unit, I think, as of now, costs about $16. Um, it's rated for, I think, it takes a minimum an input, input voltage range of about 8 to 60 volts, in that you can output 20 amps uh, that you can use to charge uh, your batteries or know whatever uh, variable DC load you want to power the good thing about this too is everything is the input and the output everything is variable the voltage is variable on the input I mean by that it means you can if you you can put in basically put in any voltage range between um, what what is specified what it is built for you can put in you will accept any any voltage range between 8 and 60 volts and then you can dial that down the output to where you want it to be so if you have with that said if you have like say 12 volts and you want 19 volts 18 volts 20, 24 volts i actually believe is the the, 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 uh, the rated output for this can go up to 80 volts at 20 amps and this supply is rated for 1500 watts um, I'm really surprised that you can buy a unit like this for only $16. It's amazing. So I'm sharing this so that um, somebody else can uh, maybe go check it out and see if you can find it useful. So it comes in, it has, um, I believe this, this here is actually the output. So you can see the, the, the potentiometer here is what you use to vary at the output voltage and this is for frequency to vary the frequency but i rather uh, i believe the default is about 150 uh, kilohertz so the this uh, part here is what you use to vary your output current so if you again if you're charging different kinds of batteries and i'm going to show this in my next video of how you can my goal for that video is to make like a super cheap uh charger uh, with um, some of the existing uh, power supplies I'm sure that you've seen them on YouTube uh, it could be a computer power supply it could be a server power supply there's a bunch of HP cheap power supplies out there that people are using um, so I'm trying to uh, I'm going to uh, incorporate two of them to uh, come up with something nice and neat at the same time affordable um, so I wanted to show, do like a mini quick review of this. This I've had this for more than four or five years, and I've been using it. I use it for multiple different applications. My in my uh, hobby project, I require a custom kind of voltage level, so I've been using it, and um, it has been quite reliable, I must say. So I wanted to share this, and hopefully somebody can uh, find this useful. And I'm going to share the link to where you can uh, actually find it on Amazon or eBay. So you can uh, take advantage of this. This I'm, I'm really, really impressed by this product.
all right guys um this is the supply that i was just showing um again like i said i bought that one uh, many years ago um but the good thing is the price hasn't gone up that much so um actually i believe the price has gone down because i bought that for about 25 dollars now the, you can get the 1200 watts uh, 20 amps um, um model of of, of the converter for only $16 so as you can see here the output goes to um, so the, the input is 8 to 60 volts and the output drives up to 12 a range of 12 to 83 volts this is really amazing um, if you're into uh, this kind of stuff um, so I believe also there are the higher uh, current uh, models that are a little bit uh, more expensive but you know depending on your application so if you need something um, if you want to be able to uh, drive higher currents or charge your batteries to higher current if you have like a lithium-ion battery banks or lipo battery banks maybe you might want to consider using this one so yeah I mean this is uh, pretty uh, um, amazing so you can also get these from actually up here is the uh, is the 30 amp uh, version of it uh, this is rated for 1500 watts so you can this is kind of what it looks like uh, this one actually comes with a kind of a cooling fan at the bottom but realistically if you're driving a lot of amperage through through this you might want to consider putting an external fan um, that's my experience with it. It does kind of start heating up, heating up. So you might want to need an, an external fan. Because if not for anything, my experience of being not only the heat sink because of the uh, the uh, the drive MOSFET and the uh, diode down here that heats up. Also, this coil here does heat up. The uh, um, inductor up here does heat up. So having a fan. To it might help you know keep it cool um, yeah this is what it looks like this is the fan that they added the bottom um, yeah but again this has to be you know if you really need something that can drive this much current I think this is really amazing so um, you can also find this on Amazon but for some reason they only have the uh, and I will leave the, the links in the in the comment section so you have uh, options of where you can find them so for some reason the ones on amazon they don't really have a lot of choice or a lot of options to for you to choose from so it seems they have the mostly the 1500 watt 30 amp one so yeah and and again this is some very amazing pictures and this here shows you the input input positive input input positive input uh, negative or ground and this is your current adjustment this is your um, output voltage adjustment and this is your constant current adjustment so the amazing thing about this and everything I'm saying has been I have tested this I've used it for a long time when he says constant current it actually does constant current so I really I really appreciate uh, the work that whoever built this uh, put into it and uh, only selling it for $30 that's, that's amazing yeah um, I'll, again I'll leave the comment um, sorry the links uh, or for uh, to where you can find them on eBay and Amazon I'll leave them in the comment section below and then if you find this helpful uh, like and possibly uh, subscribe to my channel because I am going to be my next video that's gonna come out in a few days it's gonna be actually an application of this uh, uh, this converter uh, I'm gonna be using it to, to uh, show what you can actually do a cheap uh, be it power supply it can be a power supply for you it could be a charger for you that you can hang up in your garage and comes in handy if uh, actually lately I had my one of my uh, cars the battery died and um, because we left the car sitting out in the in we didn't drive for like two weeks and the battery died drained so I was able to use this uh, 
arrangement to kind of recharge my battery for a few hours and it was good to go so it kind of does come in handy um, so and my budget for this is I'm trying to build a supply um, pretty much a very strong supply that can do up to 20 to 30 amps of charge uh, 12 to 80 volts I'm trying to do that add a fan and add a few more things and I'm trying to see if I can do it under $50 so we'll see we'll see all right uh, thanks thanks a lot I uh, appreciate it and uh, thanks for watching and